Hey, it's me Manoj Kumar Shah and today I'm going to solve the questions related to the cuboid based pyramid and then in cuboid based pyramid the base is now is square and that question is important uh, for the long questions sometimes these questions will come in 4 marks also and 5 marks also so let's uh, see the video cuboid based pyramid okay uh, cuboid based pyramid I think you understand cube means what if length, breadth and height all are not equal. If what else? Length, breadth and height are all not equal, that is called cuboid. Okay? The cuboid means what? If length, breadth is also equal but height is not equal, then that is also cuboid. Okay? So now, I am going to make here one cuboid here. Let's understand this figure. This is our cuboid. Okay? Now, Above it, I am going to make here pyramid. Here is the pyramid I make here. So now here, this is the cuboid based pyramid, but here length and breadth are equal. Here you can say this uh, base is a square. This base is we can say what? A square. Okay? And you in your SEA exam, base every time square is given. If not given, also we can find length and breadth different, also we can find out, but for SEA exam, this base are equal. It means what? This base you can say this is the square. This is the what? Square. It clear or not? So I already said this is called side. You can say side. You can say A. Okay? Length. You can say. Now you can say this breadth also. All are equal. This is also side is what? A. This is also side. A you can say. And now this is the height of what? Q y. This is the what you can say? Height of cube y. So height of cube y is denoted by y. What is the symbol? X1, what do you say? Tell. Height of pyramid is also x. And height of cube y is also say yes, then problem. No. X1, S2 we can suppose. So height of cube y, can, can I say S2? Sure, you will understand or not. So now length of this cube y also a, breadth is also a because this is the basis is square. And now height of cube y. So you can say this is the S2. This is the S2. This S2 means what? Height of cuboid. Height of cuboid. Height of cuboid. This is the S2. Okay. So now in the case of the pyramid, from here to here, it's called what? Height. This is also called what? From the vertex of pyramid, a line drawn from to the center to the base is called what? Height of pyramid. This is the height of pyramid. Height of pyramid is denoted by what here? H1. Yes, yes, two. We already said height of cuboid. S one is the height of pyramid. Okay, now slant height. You know all of you. Height, slant height. Now, if you draw from here to here line, this is called what? Slant height. This is called L. This point is called L. On the shoulder. So now, how to find LSA lateral surface area of this combined solid? How to find the total surface area of this combined solid? And how to find volume? Very easy. So let's find first of all lateral surface area. Okay? So now lateral surface area. LSA. If cuboid based pyramid given and base is what given? Square given. At that time LSA formula. Lateral surface area. Then you can say LSA of pyramid. Okay? LSA of what you can say? Pyramid plus LSA of what? Cuboid. Okay? LSA of Cuboid. So because here is the pyramid and here is the cuboid given, then LSA you are going to find then LSA plus LSA. Okay, so now LSA of pyramid square base given, then you know the formula. What is the formula? 2AR. I said no, this formula how to come? I already derived this formula in previous video. So directly you can say if square base pyramid given, then 2AR formula you can write here. Plus, now LSA of cuboid. LSA of cuboid means you can't take the base. You accept base, there is a what? For wall given. If suppose that this is the room with the cuboid room, so now if you not take base, means up one, down one. If you not take base, then what remains? One, two, three, four walls remains other. Oh, now this is the formula I will say. LSA of cuboid formula 2H2 two and L plus V. L plus V means L means also A and B means also A. A plus A. Now 2AL plus 2S2 uh, into A plus A, 2A. Now 2AL plus 2 to the 4AS2. So lateral surface area 
is equals to if q by the base pyramid is given if you don't understand how to come this formula then directly you have to remember lsa lateral surface area of q by the base pyramid what is the all of you say 2a l plus 4a x2 again say 2a l plus 4a x2 s2 it's not a square okay s2 means what height of q by S2 means what tell? I can give you L means length height, A means side, you all of you know. So this is about the LSC. Now next is TSC. Number one, uh, now number two, total surface area of this combined solid. Okay? Total surface area. How to find total surface area? Means LSC. LSA plus. Now area base, no? So LSA, you we know this up. And base, what remains here? One, this length into period. Now LSA plus, area of base, you will say. Area of base. Now LSA formula is what we say 2AL plus 4A S2 plus area base A into A. What will come? A square. Finish. Total surface area is equal to total surface area is equal to what we can say 2AL plus 4A S2 plus A square. So now for the total surface area, LSA is important. Now. So if LSA will come, if you plus A square will do then TSA will come. Look, compare this formula. TSA means LSA, LSA formula here, and area base means A square. Okay, now, third things we have to understand about the volume. Okay, how to find the volume of this cubic uh, base pyramid now? Volume. For the volume, this is very easy. Volume of pyramid plus volume of cubic. What the volume formula? Volume of pyramid plus volume of cubic. So now you can write volume of pyramid plus volume of q by so volume of pyramid what formula 1 by 3 a square x i taught you 1 by 3 a square x yes. or you can say 1 by 3 area base into height of pyramid and x means what here x1 height of pyramid we suppose what here x1 okay now plus volume of q by means what length into breadth into height so length means also a Breadth means also a, a into a, a square and height means by air s2. Therefore, volume, volume formula is what comes 1 by 3 a square s1 plus a square s2. If you understand, then it is not difficult to memorize, but we have no doubts. Okay, note sometimes a value we have to find, sometimes l value we have to find, and I taught you three notes. Remember or not? In note, always remember this sum. This is a very useful note. If L value is not given, then L square is just formula H square plus A square upon 4. This formula is important. And you can say uh, X1 here. Sometimes E square, E square is just what? L square plus A square upon 4. And if, yeah, not 4. And now 2 also. Like, if E square is just here, H square plus now A square upon 2. This three formula is also important. By help of this all formula, we can find LSA, TSA, and what? Yeah, A square by 2. Thank you very much. This is the A square by 2. Thank you, Santoshi. Okay, let's take one example. A given figure is a square uh, waste pyramid. Now, this is the square waste pyramid. Base is the square. Okay? And OA is equal to 20 per centimeter. OA is equal to what given? 20 per centimeter. Now, you can say me, OA means what? Slant height or height of pyramid? Slant height. From vertex of pyramid to a line drawn to the base is always slant height. Here, slant height, slant height, slant height L is equal to what given? 24 centimeter. Now, given here, OB is equal to 26 centimeter. OB means what then? A. OB means what then? A. Now, here, here joining line, line, here, here. This all line are A. Suppose that this is the P, then OB is the A. Then OB, then OB is the A. Suppose that here Q, then O Q is the A. If suppose that R, then O R is the A. So try to understand A means what? Clear? So now here A basically A is E is equal to what given here? 20 or uh, 26 centimeter is uh, given here. So now question is asking total surface area. Yeah? TSC of this combined solid is asking. Then write total surface area of this combined solid means what? What is the formula? What is the formula of what to write? LSA of this solid. LSA of solid plus what area of waste okay LSA of this solid formula I already developed what is the formula I say LSA 2A L plus 4A S2 plus A square 
Is it clear or not? Okay. So we now, but a value is given or not? Two. A value is given? Not given. L value is given? Twenty-four. A value is given? No. A value is not given. Yes. L value is S two. S two means height of pyramid is also given? Not given. A value is also not given. Then what comes? Forty-eight A plus four A S two plus A square. Now our duty to find A value and height of what? Height of? Yeah, pyramid also we have to find. But we have mode also. Let's use the mode. So now leave it. T S A is equal to. We don't know. Leave it this. A and S two value. Let's find it. So now how to find A value first of all? We have given E. So now we know the formula. We know the formula. E is the formula. We don't know about E S square is equal to what? L S square plus A square upon four. From here we can get A value. So now E value is what given? Twenty six A square. And now we have twenty four A square plus A square upon four. Twenty six A square. Can you tell me what is the twenty twenty six A square? Six hundred seventy six. And now twenty four A square 576. minus five hundred seventy six is equal to A square by two. Subtract to the number one hundred. Root under you can say hundred into four come no because square change into root. They are put a value. What is that? A value ten twenty meter. Yeah. So twenty centimeter a value. Now we can put here a value twenty. Okay. But uh, still we can't find. Should uh, we need what height also? The height of uh, here how to find? In the question is not given height. Means height is missing in your question. So we have to find one set of questions again. Okay? In this question, our height is missing. Here is the height suppose that here fourteen centimeter. Height of pyramid given here. Uh, we can mention in the exam uh, questions also here. Height of cuboid is equal to height of cuboid is equal to here fourteen centimeter. Height of cuboid is here. We can write fourteen centimeter. This is the missing. That's why now height is of a. We got what twenty centimeter. And now we have the height of cuboid also. Height of cuboid what s two is equal to what given fourteen centimeter. Now putting the value of a and s two in equation one. So we can write putting the <coughs> value of a and s two in equation one. Equations one we have total surface area is equal to we have forty eight a a value what we got twenty the forty eight into twenty plus four a four a value twenty s value is what given thirteen. Plus a square means twenty whole square. Please forty eight into twenty two. What will come? Forty eight into twenty. Now sixteen. Nine hundred sixteen. Very good. Now four into twenty into thirteen do. Four into twenty into thirteen. One zero four zero plus twenty square means four hundred. Now you can add this all. Nine hundred sixty plus one zero four zero plus four hundred. Or uh, what say? Twenty-four hundred centimeter square. Therefore, total surface area of this cube is this is our answer. In this way, we can solve.